It looks like anyway. Hard to tell. There you go. I'll deal with this. Ow! Asshole. Thankfully, he's very slow. He seems to be pretty weak as well. Um, get another one of those, would you? Christ. Yeah, it's all that coming again. Let's get us out in the middle, shall we? Hail of arrows. Um, we're gonna need a stamina potion. Ow, what'd you do? Just use it or something? Stop dropping faces on me. Anders, you're gonna need to move, bro. Yeah, to that. Spirit. Um, actually, use haste. Use haste. It might help us at this point. Not bad. Alright. Now, nah, crushing prison. I'm not in doubt it'll stop him or anything, but. It should hurt him. Crap. Crap. Okay, this is a good time to, uh... Use that. Taunt. Ryan's right, dead. Thank God. This, Ugh. this is a piece of the idol. No, I should have known Bartman would lie to me. Of course he'd keep a piece of the statue for himself. Think of what we could do with this. I don't know about you, Varric, but I don't want to end up like Bartram. I'm not my brother, Hawk. The idol drove him crazy, but this is just one tiny piece. Yeah. I need this thing. Six years of my life have gone into this. And there we go again. This thing's magic seems only more potent when broken. <laughs> the shard is my only hope of curing Bartrand. It's my only chance to set any of this right. <sighs> Fine. I can't believe I'm saying this. If it means that much to you, keep the shard of craziness. <laughs> no. This thing is cursed. It can bring nothing but madness. It's not your call, Blondie. Varric, I beg you, destroy this thing. I can't. I'm sorry. I want to see where this goes. Let's get out of here. I've seen enough of this damnable house to last three lifetimes. Really? Armor dust? What? I guess it just, uh. I don't think it looks any different than the way you used to have, so I don't know. Um. Post updated. Hook to Varric. And so I can't do those, probably, so I'm not gonna bother. So, yeah, we just get to talk to Varric. Um. Did he drop anything? There you go. Good boy. A rock band, really? That's it. That's very disappointing. Alright, she died. Forgot about that. Oh. Ugh. What a waste. I don't know, it's probably bad if I let him keep it, but. Yeah, whatever. I'm gonna let it, because I wanna see where it goes. I wanna see where everything goes in this game. Ugh. <sighs> Let's tea, a leg of ham, daisies for the front hall. <laughs> oh, what am I missing? So off we go to talk to Varric again. Venture forth. Up to the hanged man. Look at that, we have like no we have no quests. Literally no quests. I mean there are no side quests. Not that I can even do anyway. Kind of annoying actually. Alright, Varric, what's up? You're doing that nervous, twitchy thing again, Hawk. Don't worry. I'll be careful with the shard. You of all people know I'm trustworthy. Back in Bartrand's house, you seemed not quite yourself. 
I think getting out of that house cleared my head. I feel fine now. What are you having? Edwina, let's get a couple of <clears throat> drinks here. All right, let's close here. Now, let's see the other part. <clears throat> Hawk? Ugh. This is awkward. You? At a loss for words. <laughs> I should mark this down my calendar. Enjoy this while it lasts. It might never happen again. Look, I just want to say it has been an honor knowing you. Are you about to die? Am I? Why so serious all of a sudden? <laughs> Don't panic. I just needed to get that off my chest. You know it's six years today. Six years since I found oh, really? you dragging your tail out of Bartrand's office. Wait, what? <laughs> Here's to whatever comes next. Really? Six years have passed? Wow. Alright. Um, well, yeah, we can't really do that one, so we can only do the last straw. And even then, I don't really have much to do, so let's, uh, let's go and search for some stuff to do, guys. Oh, look at that. We have a message at the, the estate. I think I had that for a while now, and I just haven't bothered with it. Um, probably more major related stuff. Yeah, with the Konami threat gone, it seems to be just straight up, you know. Ah, you've returned. What's up? A new letter on your desk awaits your attention. Thanks. Um, that looks like it's just the Templars versus the Mages at this point. And, woo! <gasps> King Alistair. Just gonna accept all these, not gonna read any of them, I'd rather not. Walter, ah, oh, right. Don't know who that is, but okay. King Alistair. Interesting. Let's head on out, guys. I haven't seen Alice. I want it. Oh, this should be fun. Viscounts keep. I'm wondering if Togoth's gonna see Togoth. I doubt it, because they'd have to give him a voice, probably. <gasps> Let me guess. That's your final answer? Three mages have fled to Ferelden, and you have intervened to protect them, as if it is your right to do so. <laughs> what other answer did you expect, Your Majesty? A maybe might have been nice. <laughs> I do not deal in maybes. I deal in cold, hard facts. As should you. Perhaps when Ferelden next chooses a king, it will be one that takes his duty to the Maker seriously. <laughs> well, that was awkward. That just Meredith's idea of Kirkwall hospitality. Really? Kirkwall brutality? You must rip the skin off your face, then. This is the champion of Kirkwall. Right, I'm Alistair. Oh, uh, uh, King of Ferelden. And this is Tegan, my uncle. Sort of. <laughs> sort of. I'm actually Tegan. I'm only sort of his uncle. Your Majesty, may I say what an honor it is to meet you? Well, you could, but you'd be the first today. <laughs> I fought at Ostagar. What happened there was a great tragedy. You were at Ostagar? Ah, yes, it was. Sadly, Logain still lives. I can fix that. Say. Weren't you a Grey Warden once? That's the rumor. Wait. Weren't you? <laughs> That's the rumor. <laughs> <laughs> I guess we get around. I was hoping we could talk. Would have been better timing before being emasculated by Meredith, but I'm not picky. I'm surprised you would even know who I am. <laughs> I know you came here from Lothering, a Ferelden refugee that did well for himself against all odds. I have to admit, I was hoping your influence in Kirkwall might be of use. If things haven't been going well with Orlay. Without a Viscount here, however, there's only the Knight Commander to deal with. Yeah, sorry about that. You were having an argument about mages. Yes, well, apparently I don't feel the same way about mages as the Chantry does. Really? So, we're in disagreement. Wait, wait, wait. That means they get nasty. Wait. They like that. <laughs> Hold on. Last I checked, Alistair hated mages. Granted, he worked with one, but... What? I... Uh... 
What do you need me to do? Sadly, it may be too late. Meredith got wind of my arrival sooner than I hoped. <laughs> what you can do is protect Kirkwall. It will take someone like you to keep it from falling apart. Protect Kirkwall from what, exactly? You ask me, the biggest threat to this city just walked out the door. Yeah. But maybe that's the ex-Templar in me talking. Ow. Well, Wait, I suppose what? we should be getting back. <sighs> we should. The hero of Ferelden should be back in Denerim by now. <laughs> You're always so formal. He has a name, you know. <laughs> so, what annoy why didn't I receive whatever? Um I really would like some more side class. I'm gonna go to search for those real quick. But what the hell is what, what's this now? Alright, let's talk to Aveline. Fuck Aveline. I wanna go find some side quests. So, what annoys me is, he hated Templars back in Origins. Grand, yes, he was a Templar, or at least he used to be a Templar, but I don't recall him ever liking mages eventually. He has always hated them, so I don't know why to tell me that, oh yeah, you know, me and the Templars see, don't see eye to eye against mages. Bullshit. You see the exact. You have the same eyes when it comes to. Ah, uh, whatever. I don't even care anymore. Ugh. It's cool to see Alistair, though. He looks different, but that's, you know. That's Bioware for you. They've changed a lot of shit in this game. And I guess there really aren't any side quests besides these two. And I can't do that anyway, so. Let's see.